worked with them. So we started off with um, basically trying to solve the problem of compliance. But what we found is that um, there is a deeper issue with distributed models um, in terms of having different sites in different places. So these are the types of impacts that we've made to allow big organizations to um, standardize, but allow smaller organizations to get up and running faster and meet the standards that will allow for them to um, function as a company. Right now we have partners, we've partnered with large organizations, we've partnered with smaller ones, and we've also partnered with um, companies like laboratory information, information management systems to be that compliance arm for them, really pushing the boundaries right now of being able to um, introduce more discoveries to help um, with AI evaluating, just being that brain for us. Obviously, there's always the need for human intervention at this stage, but I think AI brings a lot to the game. So I think it's really up to us to really understand that this is a very crucial and important part of our healthcare system. And we all need to be supportive of technology to ensure that our scientists can do science and that we could have new developments and new technology take care of these more administrative types of work.